work. Okay, it's been a couple weeks since I've been used the Dino Wax on the product. So it's been a couple weeks since I had the product on here, Dino Wax. I'm gonna wash it and we'll have a little discussion about each product and what I think about it. So see how it got dirty at work. Hopefully you guys checked out the other videos. Nice out today, finally. And it's been raining and cold all last week. I mean, freezing. Today's the warmest day that it's been in like two weeks. I think it's like maybe 57 out today. So it feels hot compared to the last couple weeks. But we'll check it out. I'll test on that Dino Wax stuff. I didn't do the window because I got a new wind windshield been two weeks a lot of rain days on this vehicle during those two weeks I think one week it was pretty much maybe five days of rain so it's dirty so that's the effect we get let me change the nozzle here to shower pretty good I mean it's sheeting off pretty good but granted it's only been a couple weeks I'll do another update on it in a couple months, maybe three months, maybe in January. I'm going to wash it and we're going to see how it beads after I wash it because it's really dirty. As you can see, you can see all that black stuff from work. I did put wax on the, the rear window but that's jet seal. All right, let me wash it up and then I'll do another water test on a Dino Wax sealant and wax. All right, let me get to work, guys. Comes off nice and clean in this old car. Okay, when I'm done washing, I'm gonna go over the water test in the Adams the VRT that's on the black trim. Like I said, it's been two weeks, and today's the warmest day. Last couple weeks, man, we got nothing but rain and cold. I mean, last week it was like 30 degrees. So we'll go over those products real quick. Stay tuned. Okay, I'm done washing it, so let's beat it up. See how it works here. Pretty good, man. Still got a nice shine. It washed the easy too. I mean, the dirt came right off. I'm starting to get some sun, but it's all right. You keep it wet when you dry it, and you won't get water spots. Sometimes you just gotta do this stuff when it comes out. Now that's real life detailing. But looks good. I know it's only been two weeks, but it looks pretty good. So I'm going to dry it, and then I'll be back, and we're going to go over the tire dressing from Dynawax and the in, uh, Adams VIT trim. Looks pretty good, guys. What do you guys think? Tire foam, pick it up. Myers you usually buy one and get the other one half off. Works pretty good. Yeah, I got it everywhere, guys, but it's work hard. This spring, I'm gonna paint those tires up. It's not supposed to rain all week, so the stuff will last a little bit longer this week. Finally. That 
BRT held up pretty good. Considering the weather, that's for sure it held up really good. Okay, it's gonna be a quick video. So on a Dynawax tire dressing, it lasted about a week. You can see it now. Plus two, that's pretty much like I said, a lot of rain. Um, depends on the weather. Maybe if we only had a couple of rain days, it would last longer. But it rained a lot. So yeah, about a week on that with nasty weather, rain and cold. Probably get a couple weeks on it with better weather. Now the BRT trim from Adams on the black trim, it's still holding up, as you can see. Like I said, it rained a lot. A couple spots it's faded. Check out the back. Bottom. A couple spots a little dirty. I missed a spot of washing. It's gonna get dirty tomorrow at work. So yeah, black trim still holding up. It's been about two weeks, a couple spots it's faded, which, you know, understandable. I'm sure I got some water spots. I just did a quick clean of the day, but look, the water spots came right out. Get a dryer on it, it'll come out, but that's the results from it. You can see it where it's still shining. Same thing with the front. Not bad. So you figure if you do a maintenance coat on it every couple weeks, it's going to last pretty good. So I'll, VRT lasts two weeks, and it rained a lot. It rained a lot. So my opinion, that held up great with during the rain. So, yeah, good product right here. So you probably get longer on the weather. If it don't rain for, like, three weeks, it will last. Because on the Corvette, sitting in the garage, it lasted three months, the Adams. So... And then we already did the water test on the Dino Wax sealant and the wax. So it's still shining. It'd be pretty good. Man, it got some new dings on the car. Driving it to work just tears it up. A lot of semis kicking stuff up. I mean, that's new. That's new. That's new. The heck? You guys see that? When did that happen? the heck man you guys see fab do you tag my car as I when I walked away in the garage man I think he tagged my my car so I guess you guys are gonna have to go over there and check out fab auto details channel <laughs> like, well yep that's it for this video hope you guys enjoyed it and thanks for taking the time for watching I really appreciate it so these products are holding up Tire dressing about a week. VRT is really holding up. And anything on the tires in the type of weather I was driving in, and it raining all the time, going to work and coming home, you know, pretty much, not much tire dressing is gonna last through that. Um, I know on the dealer, but they won't tell me where we got the Jeep. They put some like brush on sealing on the Jeep. Man, that lasted forever, even in the rain. So, but yeah, great products to use. So. If you guys uh, have the link in the description if you guys use that link for 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 uh from amazon it kind of helps the channel out a little bit i appreciate it if you do even if you don't get the detailed product just use that link and buy something from amazon on your regular order that'd be great it helps the channel out and we can pick up some other products to test out i just did a fast washing what's up what? oh i know you get to work you said start cleaning you tell me? All right. You better help me.